Why does my tripod... Something that doesn't look right. Well, it says it's balanced, so I guess we'll just go with it. Welcome back to my channel. Sweater weather is officially upon us, at least here in Montana. In fact, by the time I post this video, I think it's going to be pretty chilly, like past sweater weather. I feel like right now, it's been in the high to mid 70s. We had like a one or two days in the 60s and now all of a sudden it's gonna drop to the 40s and 30s. There's like no good in between. So it kind of sucks. But for all of you guys who are outside of Montana and actually getting that smooth transition that you're supposed to get with fall, I think this video might be helpful for you guys. Also, I am just loving the way these curls look on my hair. I did that twist method. Um, I think the video, I will probably have that uploaded. I will probably have that tutorial uploaded to my shorts feed uh, showing how I do it. I feel like everyone is doing it and it's so simple and easy, but when I tried to like learn how to do it and do it step by step, I kept screwing up. So I just did it fast really kind of not really thinking about it but just it kind of makes sense when you're just kind of going for it um and then it was easier so really like that and all i used was an old school typical curling iron um did not spend a lot of money on did not spend a ton on it it was like maybe 40 bucks or less i'll link it down below as well as that tutorial anyway so i wanted to show you guys my vest collection my puffer vest collection i only have well actually i do have another one let me go get it. So I wanted to make a video about my small puffer vest collection because I love puffer vests and now's the time to wear them. So in my collection of four puffer vests, I have two from Amazon, one from an online boutique, but I found a good Amazon alternative that looks pretty much the same. And then one from Urban Outfitters, which I don't even know if it's available, but I just decided, you know what, I'm gonna show it in this video, make it my puffer vest collection. Okay, so I'm not really sure how I'm going to show you guys my outfit let's see if i can back the camera up and i'm already zoomed out as much as i can be that's why i need a wider angle lens so right now i'm wearing all skims skims fits everybody turtleneck and a skims pair of fits everybody leggings very soft i love these two together i just think they work so well and it's just comfortable and I love it. And I don't feel like this turtleneck is choking me like some turtlenecks feel like they do to you. So this is my outfit for the video and I just feel like it's a good way to showcase how these puffer vests look. All right, so the first one I have is from Amazon. It is a cropped puffer vest. I feel like everybody went crazy over these last year. I only have one. I really love this. It really adds to your outfit without being too much. There's actually no pockets on here, which I guess I just realized, unfortunately. But I think it works, even if I was just wearing this outfit. I think this looks cute. Also, no hood. But I remember this being really affordable and coming in a lot of other colors. I never zip this up, but if I did, here's what it would look like. Cute. And it has these strings so that you can cinch it in if you prefer. My nails are a little wet, so I'm not really going to do that. I just painted them before this video. <coughs> Enough. So definitely a good option. This is in size small. I normally, so my true size and a lot of Amazon items are small. So I got my true size in this vest. You can wear this with a blouse like this. I mean, do you call this a blouse or just a long sleeve shirt? Just a turtleneck? I'm not sure. Um, but you can wear this with just a top or you can wear this with just a regular blouse or top or a sweatshirt. It'll look good. I'm thinking of getting this in like a brown color, but I haven't ordered it yet. The next puffer vest I have is also from Amazon and also in black. I guess you would consider this a bit oversized. This is definitely a size small and it has pockets, so I really like that. I think this looks good with this outfit. This, of course, would look great with a sweatshirt as well. And I just love how cozy it is. Before I started wearing vests, I think I only like had one when we were in Colorado. And then we moved here and now I have a collection of four, which probably isn't a lot to some people, um, but it's a lot to me. Even my whole coat collection grew. I didn't have that many in Colorado. Now I have tons here. 
but I never really understood the point of vest because I was like, mm, my arms are gonna be cold. So I was never really into it. But now I definitely see the point. I can keep my body cold and my arms, I mean, they can't, I don't know, the sun's dumb. Anyways. So I really like the oversized feel. I never really zipped this up, but if I wanted to, let's see how it looks. There we go. It's not really the look that I go for with this puffer vest, so I just usually leave it open. And they have uh, little drawstrings here so that you can cinch it as, as well. And I believe this also comes in other colors. I just have it in black, so really like this one. Even though I hate cold weather, I'm secretly excited to start wearing these again because right now the way the weather is, which will shift probably by the time this was posted, um, it's a little chilly in the morning, a little chilly at night, and like perfect midday. So it's kind of hard to like wear this if I'm going out or to work because then I'm, I just start to sweat. But winter is coming. So really love this. Okay, so this next one is not from Amazon. It's the one that I said I got from a an online boutique. And you can see this definitely needs washing. So this is good that I'm making this video so that I can throw this in the wash tomorrow. So here it is. I love how just poofy it is. But at times I kind of feel like a marshmallow. So if I go sideways, you can see it's pretty wide. And there is there are no strings to cinch this in. That's just how it is. This, so the alternative I saw on Amazon comes in several other colors like green, brown, I even saw hot pink, which I'm kind of interested in getting. Um, and then of course white, and I think there might have been a few neutral colors, but it is so cozy, so warm. I do love this, and I just disregard the fact that I look like a marshmallow sideways. Like here you can see that, right? So I think last year, and I don't know if it's available this year, but I'll check. I think this is supposed to be a, another, I think this is also supposed to be an alternative to a free people version, but I haven't looked for it, but I think, but I really like this. And of course it works with this outfit. I feel like anything works with an all black outfit, you know? So very cozy and just feels great. I mean, I do look a little silly, but that's okay. Take pictures, you know, front facing. Okay, the last one is from Amazon. Oh, no. The last one I have is from Urban Outfitters. I really love this vest. It's like a, I don't know, there's just a lot going on with it, and I really like it. And this is the only one of my vests that actually has a hood. So I'll show you. I got it last year. I feel like I, I think I got all of these last year. But look, like, I feel like a superstar. Okay, so I love this because of the nice oversized hood. I like that if I want to, I can zip it up. Maybe I'll just zip it up right now. So we'll figure that out at the end. But here I have two pockets. I have little strings on the sides to cinch it in, which I already have cinched in to make it a little more fitted. And I just really love this shade of brown. And here's how I normally wear it with my hair to my side. And you can see it's just very cute. So. I've definitely grown my best collection since moving to Montana. And it's just so warm and I love it right now. So oh, this could be a whole outfit. Okay, let's figure out this zipper situation. But here, let me give you a closer look at that hood. So if you remove the hood, this is basically, this is your vest, just this top part. So let me see if I can fix this. So smooth, like butter. Let's just put my hair right here. Oh, I got twisted. There we go. Okay. 
Maybe I should just tuck my hair in. I mean, I wouldn't be wearing this if there was a blizzard, of course. I would need to cover my whole body, but let's just see. Let's just do one button. But here's how I would look. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. Yeah, I never wear it like this. <laughs> Oh, and then I can button this up. There you go. So you can be extra warm in the middle. So. There you go. Let's just put it back to the way it normally is. So this is the outfit. Um, yeah, I recommend. It's so cute. What I like about vests in general, just puffer vests in general, is that you can wear them basically with anything. You can wear them with leggings, jeans, cargo pants, I guess, since they're coming back. Pretty much everything. Like if maybe if I was actually wearing this whole outfit today, I'd probably go out with this vest because there's like a light, warm breeze. So it would just, it'd be enough, I think, for the day to run errands in. Maybe even with a hat. So like we would have a whole black on black outfit. Wow, I like this outfit so much. I wish I was going somewhere, but I already ran my errands today. I already went to Target and the grocery store. Like, maybe this could be my outfit tomorrow. Let's check the temp. But I have nowhere to go tomorrow. So tomorrow will be 53 degrees. This could be the outfit. This could be it. But where do I have to go? Nowhere. Even this works. See? It's perfect. It's just perfect. All right, guys. So that does it for this video. I just wanted to show you guys my puffer vest collection. I will link everything that I can. And I'll also check on the Urban Outfitters best to see if it is still available or if there is something similar that I can find off Amazon. I also like the fact that with the puffer vest, It'll always look good. Your outfit will always look good regardless if you're wearing something fitted like I am right now underneath it or if you wear a sweatshirt. So I feel like, I don't know, I just like the versatility of puffer vests. All right, guys, that does it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and found it helpful. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Otherwise, I will see you all in the next video. Bye.